It's Morphin' Time! Hello, this is Sanad here, and welcome to my review of the Complete Selection Modification Rider Card Set Extra. Now, this doesn't look too impressive from the outside because it is this little box, but this is essentially decade ride cards to fill in the gaps that were never completed in the original CSM or CSM 2.0. And they only work in the CSM 2.0 because of that. And what do I mean by fill in the gaps? Well, the Decade Driver 2.0, as well as the 1.0, came with all the cards you need from the series. Uh, specifically, the 2.0 comes with literally everything Decade used. And the original Complete Selection Modification DN, which I hope we'll get a version 2 at some point, contains all the cards that DN used in the series. This is cards that never previously existed, uh, slash cards that were used in the series, like, for example, this version of Decade's Henshin that looks like Violent Emotion. But what you got here is things like Ultimate Form of the Dark Eyes, G3X, Tiger, Garen Jack Form, uh, Zeronos Zero Form, Kuga Rising Titan, things that you would technically have cards of that didn't have cards prior, like the masked forms for the Kabuto Riders. And these now have new sounds in the Decade Driver 2.0, and yeah, it's pretty deep. Like, there's Kiva Flight style. So it's pretty cool. And then you also get final attack ride cards for all of the Showa riders that we didn't previously have, which is basically everybody but Amazon. Uh, yeah, so it's a pretty extensive set, and I think that it's definitely worth having if you have the 2.0 Deca Driver. But let's hear some of these sounds, because a lot of this is going to be new that we never really had sounds for prior, and that is pretty exciting for a driver as old as this one. So I figured to keep this simple, we'll just go in the order that the card set presents them as, and just go one by one through each card, starting with the Violent Emotion version of Kamen Rider Decade. It's only slightly different from the normal Henshin, in fact, it might be the same. Uh, let's compare that barcode. This is one I was kind of curious about, was that is it going to be different? And it is. It does have some slightly different sound effects to it. It's not like it says Violent Emotion, because it didn't in the movie it's from, but you can see there are differences between the two versions of Decade from the TV show and Decade from Movie War 2010, when he sort of went evil as Violent Emotion Decade. Uh, but that's pretty much, you know, it's a similar card, but it is different. Now, in terms of things like the Dark Eyes right, uh, Ultimate Kuga, you're probably wondering... Is that any different from the other Ultimate Kuga card we got? And uh, yeah, there actually are different. Uh, just like just like with Decade, it will make a slightly different sound from the Red Eyes version. Uh, and then, you know, when it comes to Rising Ultimate, that is the case as well. And I do appreciate that there is some difference. It's not just, oh, hey, we, you know, selected the eyes and changed the color from red to black. They actually did change the barcode and they did change the sound within. So yeah, from here, let's just go into sound demo mode and go through these, because that's pretty much the last of the sort of comparisons we need to make with the ones that come with the 2.0 Deca driver. Charge up! 
Look at Abyss being in the Ryuki section where he belongs.
So my friend Hellfire Ray sent me a video by Actar Rykit showing some special codes for the K-Touch that weren't in the instruction manual, and I thought for the sake of completion I would also repeat them there, but I will link the original video in the description. And these are kind of amazing. So let's go through them. The first one is the numbers off of Decade's logo, which had these like little barcode numbers, and that is 453154, or sorry, 453145. So it's a message from Tsukasa to Rich uh, Kamen Rider, a happy 50th anniversary. This next one is from DN's logo, which is 495144. And that's Narutaki's classic Onore Dikedo as a Onore Diendo. Uh, then 555 is the uh, Henshin code for Kamen Rider Fies. So you get a little line. No, 913 doesn't work. So no Kaisa line. Uh, 0320 is Masahiro Inoue's birthday, and he's the actor that plays um, Kaduya Sakasa, Kamen Rider Decade. And this one activates a special version of the Decade Complete Henshin. So you get Tsukasa saying the names for Decade Complete. And then this one's kind of interesting because uh, the actual, like, programming code for the colors uh, pink and magenta have specific lines. Again, I don't know how to discover all these. It's kind of amazing. But uh, we got 663032. That's uh, Sukasa saying it's not pink, it's magenta, because he's always talking about the color on his costume, his rider suit and stuff. It's not pink, it's magenta. And then we put in the code for magenta, which is 530083. And that's him talking about the color code for magenta. And that's uh, that's it for this thing. Uh, you know, seven more codes to add seven more sounds, which is honestly pretty cool. If there's any other secrets, uh, let me know. So that pretty much does it for the Rider card set extra. I think these are fantastic. Adding to the roster of ride cards for things that we never got to see in the show is awesome. And I hope that maybe one day if we do get a Neo Decade Driver CSM, we would also get another card set extra to fill in those gaps. And if you are wondering where cards like Knight or Scissors or any of them, they got released with the Complete Selection Modification D end, which we have not heard of a version 2 happening yet but it seems almost inevitable. And we will look at those cards in the next video because I'm going to be doing a comparison of the CSM 2.0 with the 1.0 with the Neo, as well as using those DN cards and testing the Neo cards to see what works in this driver. And that'll be the next video. So you want to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you don't miss out on that. Also hit the like button while you're down there and leave a comment down below and let me know any questions you have about any of these releases. And yeah, I mean, that's pretty much it for this video. If you somehow missed the video of the Decade Driver as well as the K-Touch, go check it out. It is still on the channel. You will see it at the playlist at the end of this video. 
it is worth seeing because it's going to have all the features and all the cards and all the rundowns of everything about this release. There is one more video to go on this initial set, and there will be a Ride Booker video in the future when I get the Ride Booker. So stay tuned. There is plenty for Decade on this channel. Also, be sure to check out Hero Club at hero-club.com for hero news and more. And my awesome graphic designer on Twitter at darklaw 643 And until next time, this is Sanat saying goodbye.